Hey guys, Anthony here with a tutorial on how to improve audio quality in Audacity. Audacity is a free open source audio recorder and editor that I use often. In a previous video, I showed you how to record a voiceover in Audacity. And in this video, I'll show you how to enhance the audio quality. Here I've got two audio tracks. The top one is the original recording. And the bottom one is the enhanced edited version. So let me play the original recording. This is a test recording to demo the voiceover feature in Audacity. And this is the enhanced version. This is a test recording to demo the voiceover feature in Audacity. As you can tell, the enhanced audio sounds much better than the original recording. These are the steps that I've used to improve the quality of this audio clip. So this is the original audio I recorded. You will notice that I recorded 5 seconds of silence at the end. That's because we needed to remove any background noise. And that is generally the first thing I do, that is remove background noise. I created a separate tutorial to show you how to do this in more detail. But let me briefly show you how to do this. First I highlight the 5 seconds of silence on the audio track. Then go to the Effect tab and choose Noise Reduction. You will see this dialog box. Click on Get Noise Profile. Next, highlight the whole audio track. You can use Ctrl A on your keyboard. Then go back to Effect and choose Noise Reduction again. Leave the settings as default and click OK. Next, go back to Effect and choose Compressor. Use the default settings and click OK. Next, go back to Effect and choose Normalize. Again, I use the default settings and click OK. Next, go back to Effect and choose Equalization. And under Select Curve, choose Bass Boost and click OK. Next, go back to Effect and again choose Equalization. And this time under Select Curve, choose Treble Boost and click OK. Next, go back again to Effect and choose Bass and Treble. You can adjust these sliders depending on your audio and preview it before applying it. In most cases, the default settings work for me. And then click OK. Next, go back to Effect and choose Limiter. I set the hard limit to minus 4 decibels and then click OK. And then finally, I apply the amplify effect in order to increase the overall volume of the audio. I check this allow clipping box and generally increase the amplification in increments of 2 decibels. If you ever need to undo an effect, go to the edit menu and use these undo and redo options. And finally, you can export your audio by going to the file menu and choosing export audio. For explanations on each of the effects that I use to improve the quality of the audio, check the description section. Now bear in mind that these exact settings may not necessarily work for you, but the important thing is that if you take the time to understand these various audio effects, you will be able to enhance the quality of your audio by using Audacity. Well, hope you found this tutorial helpful. Look for more Audacity tutorials on my YouTube channel, and thanks for watching.